Hello friends and family and good morning from Memphis, Tennessee. We've been staying right behind us at Elvis Presley's guest house, but we want to take advantage of the early opening time for the meditation garden. If you're not going to Graceland and you want to pay your respects to Elvis Presley, Lisa Marie Presley and the entire family, it does open to the general public to go to the meditation garden from 7.30 to 8.30 and then Graceland officially opens at uh, 9 a.m. So we're going to head on over to uh, the meditation garden head over there for free I do want to sign our names on the wall you're able to do that as well I'll show you how you do that and uh, we'll probably go check out Elvis Presley's planes the Lisa Marie and uh, taking care of business but before we get started if you would subscribe and click the bell notification so you wear future uploads and live streams we would greatly appreciate it I did want to take a moment to show you the front of uh, Elvis Presley's guest house uh, resort here. This is very, very beautiful. They do have shuttle buses that take you over to Graceland every half hour, so you wouldn't have to pay the uh, $10 parking fee. Another little upgrade to staying here at the guest house. But be on the lookout for that video. I have an entire tour of the uh, guest house. The great thing about staying over here at Elvis Presley's guest house, you can literally walk to everything. We're gonna take advantage of being so close to Graceland. It's right over here. We're just gonna walk over this morning, pay our respects, sign the wall. Like I was saying, I just wanna show you guys Lisa Marie taking care of business. It's something else. It's like it's a piece of history. Like Elvis just transcends just music. He's just the, the, the person, the Hall of Famer, the father, the son. He's everything, so let's go check it out. And it's really crazy walking up from the guest house, like Graceland is right across the street, probably literally just a two or three minute walk. And then right over here from the road, I know they have some construction vehicles and whatnot, kind of blocking our path. But right behind there, you could see, just by driving by the Lisa Marie and his other plane taking care of business. Lisa Marie is the bigger one. We'll take a look at those uh, right after we pay our respects. Okay, so we're just making our way here to the gates of Graceland, and literally you can sign just about everything. Like people put the uh, lightning bolt taking care of business. Of course, you could write your name and so on. Right underneath, somebody actually drew Elvis Presley uh, taking care of business. But here is the uh, main gates of Graceland. Really crazy, there's so many pictures of Elvis Presley standing in front of these very, very famous gates. You can see them wide open now, like I was saying, you can come here from 7.30 to 8.30 every morning and uh, go up to the meditation garden, and you just have to walk right up there. We're gonna do that in just a few moments. I did want to show you some famous pictures though of Elvis uh, standing in front here of the gates of Graceland, but you could see all the music notes and Elvis playing the guitar. Let's see what we have here though. Here's one of the uh, pictures. Elvis standing in between both of the gates while they're barely open. Let's see what else we can find here. So Elvis right there is actually standing on the outside where we are at the moment with his gates closed, kind of looking up there. And another shot here of Elvis Presley looking very dapper standing out in front of the gates. Again, you can see those music notes and then Elvis um, over here on the wrought iron playing the guitar. That same thing is right over here in that picture. Like, isn't that crazy cool? Like, what a piece of history. But through the years, these are the uh, bricks here of Graceland, so you obviously can't climb over or anything. But uh, yeah, there's everybody's names. There's like a Todd and Lisa, Larry and Mary Ann. People even put some of their stickers up there. You could, uh, you could sign your name on here. I do believe they sandblast this every few years. I'm not exactly sure of the whole like protocol, but they do sandblast and start all over again. It looks like on the uh, wrought iron fencing part, it looks like somebody also put a lock. It's two hearts on there too, that's really cool. But the gates of Graceland go all the way down this way, the walkway, and completely down the entire road here. So all of this is basically all signed up. We're definitely gonna have to find ourselves a spot to uh, put our names. But yeah, look at this, this is so awesome. Just all the different colors, and people have also started to uh, 
write their names on the ground here in Graceland as well. We have uh, 2023, lots of people in 2023. JB loves Elvis. And some really talented artists here. Look at that. You have Elvis Presley like images drawn onto the ground. This is the view we're dealing with though. We will get a closer look at the Graceland Mansion as we walk through that walkway, but it's literally just right up ahead. Okay, so I think we're gonna go ahead and sign about right here, just because I don't see too much going on. We'll write, uh, Sable Family Vlogs. Mm -hmm. 2023, there we go. It's almost 2024, but right now we're here in 2023. I also did want to point out to the right hand side of the fence here, they do have like a little guard shack. This would have been where Elvis's security would have been as well. That building is also still here on Graceland property. Okay, so we're taking the walking path. This is exactly where the uh, bus trail would take you if you're doing the Graceland tours. It does pull over here to the left hand side, but we can get a, get a closer look of the Graceland mansion. It's just so like peaceful over here like off the road like set off and recess the houses but everything is so well taken care of and maintained look at that though how many times elvis presley would have been just walking up this walkway to his house here at graceland and they do like to put like little signs in the ground like i see over here for the meditation garden that's going to be over here to the right up that walking path it looks like they're going to put a nativity up here as well for the holiday season. Lots of good stuff going on here at Graceland. As you keep taking like a few more footsteps, heading back a little bit further, it just starts getting more and more quiet. Like you can just hear the trees rustling in the wind. Very beautiful outside this morning. I really like where they put the nativity as well. Like it's not all set up at the moment, but you kind of get like a grand reveal of the uh, Graceland Mansion now, like right behind it, tucked away. The first thing you'll see if you do come do the meditation gardens in the morning is uh, Elvis Presley's pool, that classic bean shaped pool. It's still here on display with the original tiles. It looks like they do have a uh, pool cleaner in there scrubbing it. Then over here is the uh, racquetball course. Can you imagine the parties that Elvis had probably walking out of this back door right there into his pool area? Everything is so beautifully well done though, well maintained, like all the flowers, all the little shrubs and trees are properly cut over here to the uh, meditation gardens. So many people do come here obviously to pay their respects. You have Benjamin Storm Presley, that would have been Lisa Marie's son, like buried right here next to her, like that is so sad. It's decorated beautifully though with the uh, flowers, the pictures, a bunch of crosses you can actually see in that picture there Benjamin with Lisa Marie it's nice that people come out though and put all the flowers and like plushies and stuffed animals out here there's some pictures right over there lots of pictures of uh, Benjamin there's like a little collage here we have some like duckies some crosses and like I was saying, there's a picture right there of Lisa Marie and then Benjamin. And he's right over here next to his mother, of course, Lisa Marie. This whole uh, area is decorated so beautifully as well. Lisa Marie Presley, isn't that crazy? In loving memory, Graceland's princess, Lisa Marie Presley.
lots of flowers over here in this area as well. You could actually see some pictures here. Lisa Marie and Michael Jackson. Of course, Lisa Marie and, uh, and her uh, father, Elvis Presley. But there's lots of things left out in this area as well, like the crosses, the little stones with hearts. As I sit in heaven, a sign that they have. And look at this beautiful picture of uh, Lisa Marie in front of the uh, pearly gates. On this rock, it has uh, Lisa Marie painted on there. They have lots of nice stones in the ground, basically everywhere over here. This one reads, Sunshine of Our Home, Gladys Love Presley, April 25th, 1912 to August 14th, 1958. And then over here is a ginormous uh, cross. It says Presley at the bottom. But the next spot I do want to show you is in memory of Jesse Karen Presley, January 8th, 1935. You can see the praying angels on the corners with the flowers, and then one praying there on the other corner. This would have been Elvis Presley's stillborn brother. That's so crazy, like he had a twin. Now buried here at the uh, Graceland Mansion. Then right next to uh, Jesse, is uh, Gladys Love Smith Presley, April 25th, 1912 to August 14th, 1958, wife of Vernon Elvis Presley, mother of Elvis Aaron Presley, and Jesse Karen Presley. She was a great person, a great wife, and great mother. She was loved by so many. We loved her dearly and is missed sadly. And then right next to Gladys Love Smith Presley is Vernon Elvis Presley. This is uh, Elvis's father, April 10th, 1916 to June 26th, 1979. Son of Jesse D. Presley, Minnie Mae Presley, father to Elvis Aaron Presley, Jesse Presley, and grandfather of Lisa Marie. It says, for when that the greater scorer comes to write against your name, he writes that you will, that you won or lost, but how you played the game. They're right next to Vernon, they do have a memorial here. It says uh, to Elvis in memoriam, that's the light that's lit up right in front of his headstone. It says, you gave yourself to each of us in some manner. You were wrapped in thoughtfulness and tied with love. May this flame reflect our never ending respect and love for you. It may serve you as a constant reminder to each of us, your eternal presence. Elvis Aaron Presley. Then here's Elvis's right here. Oh my word, isn't this crazy, guys? Elvis's headstone, it says Elvis, Aaron Presley, January 8th, 1935 to August 16th, 1977. Son of Vernon Elvis Presley and Gladys Love Presley. Then it says, uh, father of Lisa Marie Presley. But look at all the flowers and amazing pictures of Elvis that they have right in front here. This is so beautiful, like how they have this decorated. So some people even came and put some notes to Elvis, some personalized things like the sign that somebody made for Elvis. There's lots of guitar picks. It's something else. Then at the bottom, it says by Vernon Presley. Then you have Elvis's classic lightning bolt there, TCB, for taking care of business.
And then last but not least, right next to uh, Elvis Aaron Presley, you do have the uh, tombstone of Minnie Mae Presley, June 17th, 1890 to May 8th, 1980. Oh, this is crazy. 1980, the estate of Minnie Mae Presley. It says, in memory of Vernon Elvis with love, with all the hearts and arrows. Her children rise up and call her blessed. Her husband also, he praiseth her. She was a gracious lady, a precious mother, and virtuous woman. In simplicity, she taught us with God-given wisdom. She guided us through hardships and heartaches and taught us how to look to God for our strength. She has a uh, angel on the corner there on the right hand side and a nice flower here at the bottom. Even if you don't have a ticket to come to Graceland, I highly suggest you come to the Meditation Gardens. Like I was saying, it's open every morning from 7.30 to 8.30 before the bus tours start to come shuttling everybody over here who bought a ticket. But we bought the ticket the other day, it was like $80. It was well worth it though. Like it's really incredible being able to walk through Elvis Presley's house, see his belongings and pay your respects. And then over there at the museums, it's second to none. I do want to show you across the street the Lisa Marie and the uh, taking care of business plane. 
but it's even really crazy to be standing on the other side of the fence looking in seeing Graceland at the top of that rolling hill and again Elvis would have taken the same pathway so many times I'll try to get us zoomed in. Right across the street is Elvis's larger plane of the two. That's the Lisa Marie. It does say Lisa Marie on the front. The paint is still very, very bright and vibrant, just like it was many, many years ago. In a moment or two, I'll head a little bit further down so we can take a closer look at Elvis's taking care of business. Here's some of the things that uh, Luke wrote. It says, thank you for letting me into your home by Luke. Luke put that right over there. And then my mom put here for Bob and Kathy, love Elvis with a smiley face. Then as you could tell, lots of people do uh, commemorate the stop sign here out in front as well. Look at that though. On the bottom, Brandy put our uh, YouTube, Sable Family Vlogs with the YouTube logo. Here's a better look across the street at the Lisa Marie. You could see where the name, like I said, is still on the, uh, the aircraft right there on the left-hand side. The taking care of business plane is over to the right-hand side, kind of recessed back a little bit. You could see the tail of it. It definitely dwarfs in comparison to Lisa Marie. We toured both of these planes though. The Lisa Marie is more of like his uh, concert touring plane, I believe, and then the taking care of business is the smaller of the two, obviously. Just get where you're going from point A to point B. It's truly a very humbling experience coming here to Graceland, being able to pay your respects to probably the greatest ever. I mean, let's be honest, Elvis Presley, like who is better than Elvis Presley? And Lisa Marie Presley, Vernon, Gladys, Minnie Mae, I mean, they're all here. It's something else, it really, it's very touching. Like, you kind of lose your words there for a moment or two and try to gather yourself and think about what you're talking about, what you're doing. I had a pleasure coming out, though, to the meditation garden, the gates of Graceland, to show you guys around. It was just a really good morning. Hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. If you liked today's video, give it a big thumbs up. And as always, make today awesome.